I'm not sure I should. I'm not it's telling me to exit. I don't think I should though. I can Good day everyone, this is Wings95 back with another Detroit Become Human video and in the last video we uh, played as Connor and we did that little demo uh, mission that I've already done on this channel so you would have gone back and watched the demo but then we went to uh, Marcus who just picked up some paint and then got beaten up on the way back, that was kind of interesting and then uh, to Kara who cleaned up the entire house for um, some lazy dad Todd and then became slightly better friends with Alice, we, the kid. We found out a few things. There's a lot of abuse in the family and all that. It's not a good situation. Anyway, we're back. Uh, I don't even know. I assume this is Marcus getting off the bus. I, I assume. Yep, there, there's Marcus. Uh, is, is this my house? Or do I still have to walk to my house? Because this is a pretty nice area. Marcus, uh, oh, wow. It is, actually is my house. That is a nice house. Thank you. I, wow, I must be like a really expensive android to be working in this house. Deposit package. Where? Over there? Or, yep, put down. There we go. Bellany paints. Awesome, I can hang up my jacket. I kind of look like a normal dude. Just, I'm an android. Take care of Carl. Wake up Carl upstairs. Okay, I wonder if there's going to be another kid or... My master? I'm not 100% sure. Where, where is Carl? It doesn't look like he's over there. That looks kind of weird. A skeleton? Of some sort of dinosaur or something? Is Carl in here? Oh, that opened. Draw curtains. Okay, oh, that's, uh, that's definitely not a kid. So, it seems like some rich old dude. Draw them open. Oh. Wow. Got tats and all that. Good that's morning, interesting. Carl. Good morning. It's 10 a.m. 10 a.m. Wow. Cloudy, 54 degrees. 80 percent humidity slept with mate. a strong possibility of afternoon showers. It sounds like a good day to spend in bed. Yeah. Probably not I wrong. I did go to pick up the paint that you ordered. Oh yes, I've forgotten. Well, I that hadn't. Is the difference between you and me, right, Marcus? You never forget anything. No, never. Show me your arm, please, Carl. No. Carl. <laughs> Thank you. I was like his caretaker. I just opened my eyes and I'm already gritting my teeth. Okay, I won. That one. Humans are such a fragile machine. Yeah, they, they are. Break down so quickly. Not All 70 odd years. To keep them going. Hey. What happened to your clothes? Oh, it's nothing. Just some demonstrators in the street, Carl. Oh, yeah, they bet me up. They think they can stop progress by roughing up a few androids? Yeah, they can't. I hope they didn't harm you. Oh, no, no. They just pushed me around, Carl. I'm fine. Okay. Yeah, they, they got to do a lot more to hurt, to hurt an android. That one, I'm, I'm, I'm learning... The the L1s and R2s and all that. It's so much easier if it was just like left trigger, right trigger. Come on. Terrible. That's a nice bathroom you got here. Oh, and all the doors open automatically. I guess they have to if um, you're in a wheelchair. And yeah, now I'm, now I'm giving them a, a shower. Or bath or something. That's great. Okay, we're doing this again. Left uh, bumper and forward and then we're gonna put him in the wheelchair I assume there we go I wonder what he did with his life he seems rich he seems uh, pretty nice but he's got tats everywhere so who knows what he used to do they go to the dining table today. maybe breakfast yes, there's the opening of your retrospective at the Museum of Modern Art mm -hmm. the gallery Museum of Modern Art messages asking to confirm your attendance hmm. Wow I haven't decided yet We'll see about that later. Okay. What else? Okay, we may Just or may not go mail. there. I've already answered. Hmm. Oh, you got fan mail? That's pretty cool. Any news from Leo? Who's Leo? No, Carl. 
I can call him if you like. No. No, don't bother. Okay, seems like you've got some things that you might need to take care of uh, there, Carl. I feel like we should go to this um, retrospective at the art museum. That'd be great. I'll go see some art. I'm starving. Well, well it is 10 a.m. Bacon and eggs, just the way you like them. Thank you, Marcus. You're welcome. Seems like these two have a pretty nice friendship. One taking care of the other, even though, yes, I, I am an android, but still. Doesn't mean I can't be friends with some old dude that's obviously quite sick. But where's these bacon and eggs? There it is. Oh, take. Yeah, there we go. And, wow, that looks like a pretty nice breakfast. Well, it's got a smiley face on it. That's pretty cool. Pick it up. And take it to him. This really is so far just like a... Like, like a, well, one was a cleaning house simulator. This is a looking after people simulator. Um, I assume it's going to get intense at some point. But it's still somewhat enjoyable. Very interesting. Oh, look at those bacon and eggs. You, Doesn't look like Television. much, though. That's uh, a nice uh, coffee. Still with the smiley face on it. And he's watching TV. Oh, even putting the napkin on the lap. And what are those? Like some peaches or something? Why don't you finish my breakfast? Sure. Hmm? Okay, Carl. So we gotta do something. Breakfast served, you have all that. Take care of Carl, yep. Anything else? Find something to do. Okay. What is there to do? Let's have a look around here. There's, okay, there's a few things around here. I count five. So let's go over to the table, read. Oh no, I don't like reading. We saw that in the last video. Let's have a look around Detroit today. Life found on Titan. Oh, that's that's interesting. Not really. Yeah, anyway, I don't care about life. Wow, that was quick. Yeah, it's true. Nothing but greed. Stupidity and violence. Greed, you're in a mansion. Five thousand years of civilization just to get to where we are. Five thousand years, okay. Probably uh, derive a date from that, where this is set, but uh, I'm not 100% sure. Chess, oh, we could finish our chess game. Um, we could play. Let's, let's see if there's something else to do. I want to keep looking around. There were, there were three more things. There's a, there's a giraffe. Wow. Okay. Okay, we could play the piano. Um, but there's still two more things to do that I want to look at. Over here. We could read. I don't want to read. There was one more thing there. Is it that? Oh, there's no, something over there. Look at the globe. Yeah, let's do some geography. That's something great to do uh, after brekkie. Come on. Spin. Oh. Spin, wow, that was, uh, that was fun. Do you want to play some chess, Carl? Because I feel like that would have been the funnest thing to do. Play. Sit down. You coming over, Carl? Oh, well, he's resetting the board, okay. <clears throat> Fancy game of chess? Sure, yeah. Speed chess. Speed, Speed chess. chess. Win, lose, or draw. I didn't press anything. I don't know. Lose. Oh. That was just a little bit too easy. Are your circuits rusty? Or are you just taking pity on it? Uh, neither? Uh, true. Well, I thought you'd enjoy winning. Never throw a match, Marcus. If you can win, win. That's Let's what play again, humanity then. where it is today. He seems to be a wise old man. One day I won't be here to take care of you anymore. And I won't be here to take You'll care have of to you then. Yourself and make your choices. Decide who you are and want to become. I'm an android. I'll probably be like decommissioned this world when you die. Wouldn't like I? Those who are different, Marcus. Don't let anyone tell you who you should be. Let's go to the studio. 
Wow. It's like I'm his son or something, but I'm just an android he bought. Yeah, I, I like this dude, though. He's, he's cool. Didn't get to play uh, the piano or anything, though. And he did win a game of chess. Speed chess. That was... That was great. He was still able to win, though. It's very dark in here. Oh, not anymore. Wow. This is quite a studio. That's crazy. So, you're an artist. But is that what gave you your millions? Uh, I don't know. Are you gonna draw some more? Nice paint palette there. Oh, it's picked him up. That's crazy. Where we left off. Remove the sheep. Is that me? Okay, I have to remove the sheep. Okay. Wow. That's that's quite a painting. So now I'm just watching, and now I can clean the studio while uh, he does his thing. What do I need to clean though? Is there anything over here? Got some sculptures. That's all pretty cool. Anything over here? Oh, clean. I didn't even know that was there. Got a lot of uh, different paper here. Maybe different uh, plans for drawings or something like that. Anything else? No. That's the one. Oh, that's a button I wanted. There are two things over there. Uh, what are they? There's something there. Oh, there's the paint. <laughs> Well, we uh, saw that again. Okay, interesting. I guess it all was kind of making sense now that he wanted paint, given um, you know, he's a he's a painter, but I didn't know that at the time. There's uh something else to do over here. Maybe over here at the sink or something. Oh, well, there's something to look at. Interesting. Okay. Anything else? Uh, I already. No, I need. I I do need to clean that. I haven't cleaned that yet. More uh, of a cleaning up simulator, like uh, in the last video. There's one more thing, and then I guess we talk to Carl. Some over here with the sculptures. Oh, no, okay, we just initiated some. Well, if he only does like two minutes of time, that's going to take absolutely forever to do. It is looking great, though, I think. I don't know. I don't really know much about art. So... What's your verdict, Marcus? Well, it's great. Yes, there is something about it. Hmm. I have something to say it's I great, though. Quite define. I guess I like it. The truth is, I have nothing left to say anymore. Each day that goes by brings me closer to the end. I'm just an old man clinging to his brushes. Carl. But enough about me. Let's see if you have any talent. You want me to paint? Give it a try. Try painting something. Paint? But would I... Painting what? Anything you want. On well, Android. I'm not meant to want. <laughs> okay. I have a palette. Look, my master has told me to do something. I'll do it. What am I going to paint? Find a subject to paint. Um. How do I do that? Looking around. Paint Carl's painting? Nah, that's just copying. Uh. Paint statue. Okay. I'm, I, I'm, I'm painting. I'm painting, guys. Look at me go. Left. I will... I'm an android, so surely this painting is going to be absolutely amazing. Oh, wow, okay. That is a perfect copy of reality. That, painting that, that was great. Replicating the world, it's about interpreting, improving on it, showing something you see. Carl, I don't think I can do that. It's not in my program. I... Go on, I'm an android. Go on, try it. Grab that canvas. Now I'm supposed to interpret something. Do something for me. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Trust me. I trust you, Carl. Oh, gotta hold it. 
Okay. Try to imagine something that doesn't exist. Something I'm an android. Seen. I can't do that. Now okay. Imagine something I can't. I haven't seen yet. That, that, I might be able to do that. And oh, I'm going yellow. Across the canvas. Android's humanity identity. Identity? Oh, I accidentally pressed prisoner. I don't know what the other ones were. No, not prisoner. I love this. I feel like I did the wrong thing. Oh, I'm not happy with my decision because I accidentally made the decision. It wasn't a real decision. I want to know what the others were. Like, I, I can't even remember. I I'll, I'll, I'll guess I'll look at them back when I'm editing, but... I have no idea. I, I, I didn't want prisoner, though. What's Carl gonna think of it? I think that I hate this place. Oh wow, that! Oh my god, that's quite a painting. Oh, who's that? Hey, Dad. Is that Leo? Leo. Hey. Who is? I didn't hear you come in. No, I was in the neighborhood. I thought I'd stop by. It's been a while, right? You want money, you know, don't you? You don't look so good. Oh yeah, yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> hey, listen. Uh, I hey. I knew it. Again. What happened to the money I just gave you? Uh, well, it just goes, you know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you're on it again, aren't you? No. No, no, I swear it's not that. No, don't lie to me, Leo. What difference does it make? I just need some cash. That's all. Sorry. The answer is no. What? Why? As it should you be. Know why? Definitely should be. Yeah, yeah, I think I do know why. <laughs> you'd rather you'd rather take care of your uh, plastic toy here than your own son, right? Tell me, Dad, what's what's he got that I don't? Smarter, more obedient, not like me, right? But you know what? This thing is not your son. It's a fucking machine. Leo, that's enough. Enough. You don't care about anything except yourself and your goddamn paintings. You've never loved anyone. You never loved me, Dad. You never loved me. Well, that was terrible. It looked like um he he really did Carl really did care about Leo. Like he was asking, "Oh, did Leo check in?" It should have. Mm, I don't like Leo. Um, okay, the other ones were um androids despair doubts. I probably would have went doubts. I reckon, not prisoner. A anyway, hopefully that doesn't affect it slightly. I did like that one. I like Carl. I really do. Hopefully he, um, stays around for a while. He probably won't, though, because he's old. Oh, we're back with Connor. Okay. I wasn't expecting to be with him at a bar. No androids allowed. I'm an android. This isn't gonna go well. What's going to happen? Where's Lieutenant Anderson? I'm not supposed to be in here, though. Oh, yeah, do the whole scanny thing. I pressed right. Uh, I pressed that one instead. Okay. Anderson, Anderson, Anderson. Scan faces. Well, I doubt it's that guy. Nope, it's not. Jimmy Peterson. Doubt it's that guy. But, come on, give me a scan. Derek Myers. No criminal record, though. That, that's good. That guy? Edward Dempsey. Still no, uh, Shit, anything. Okay, now let's stand here. What about you? Come on. Do it. Jonah Graham. Unemployed, of course. Everybody's unemployed. He looks nice for an unemployed guy, though. Okay, what about you? 
Well, what, what, who are you? Scanning. Christopher Gray, unemployed. DUI. I'm not sure what DUI means, but he does have a criminal record. Who's that? That is Lieutenant Hank Anderson. Police Lieutenant. Okay. The other guy I want. Introduce yourself. Who's that? I just want to check who this guy is. Kim Yohan. Delivery driver. Currently unemployed. Domestic abuse. Oh, lovely, mate. Okay. Let's talk to this Lieutenant guy. Anderson. My name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. Well, I've heard I that before. The station, but nobody knew where you were. They said you were probably having a drink nearby. I was lucky to find you at the fifth bar. What do you want? You were assigned a case early this evening. A homicide involving a Cyberlife android. In accordance with procedure, the company has allocated a specialized model to assist investigators. Well, I don't need any assistance. Especially not from a plastic asshole like you. Just be a good little robot and get the fuck out of here. Okay, um, let's Listen, reason with him. I think you should stop drinking and come with me. It'll make life easier for both of us. I don't think he's gonna do that. Um, understanding? I understand that some people are not comfortable in the presence of androids. But I, I am perfectly comfortable. Now back off before I crush you like an empty beer can. You can't do that to me. Thank you. Um. I apologize, Lieutenant. I guess I I'll just wait. I'll wait for you outside. Take your time. I guess androids don't say homicide. really care about time, do they? Is it the homicide of that dad? Uh, yeah, yeah, I, I'm pretty sure it was. Because they said that it was the very first ever time uh, Android killed uh, someone, a human. But this isn't, this isn't it. Oh, that guy got really close to that girl though. Wow, uh, he almost ran him over. Anyway. You wait here. Okay, um... Diplomatic. My instructions are to accompany you to the crime scene, Lieutenant. Listen, I don't give a fuck about your instructions. I told you to wait here, so you shut the fuck up and you wait here. Okay. Conflicting orders, selecting priority. Follow Lieutenant Anderson. I'm not sure I should. Channel 16, can you confirm that this is a homicide? I'm not confirming uh, anything. It's telling me to exit. I don't think I should, though. I don't know. How long is he going to take? I don't want to just... Nah, okay, let's go. I waited for you. A little bit. Now I need to see the crime scene for myself. Because that will help. Can, can I let you in? It's with me. Thank you. What part of staying in the car didn't you understand? Your I did for a little bit. My instructions, Lieutenant. You don't talk, you don't touch anything, and you stay out of my way. Got it? Got it. Evening, Hank. We were starting to think you weren't going to show. Well, I was he wasn't to going this to. Found me. So, you got yourself an android, huh? Oh, very funny. Just tell me what happened. Landlord, okay. For a few months. You just let somebody live in your house for a few months without any contact. Jesus, that's smell. great. That looks like he's been dead for a long time. I am alive. I don't think you are, actually. He has a record for theft and aggravated assault. Lovely. According to the neighbors, he was kind of a loner. Stay Sounds like one. Most of the time, they hardly ever saw. Uh, stay he's in. Wasn't worth calling everybody out in the middle of the night. Oh, Could've come on. Let me analyze. I'd say he's been there for a good... Okay. Carlos Ortiz. 19 no days ago. The gets here. There's a kitchen knife over here. Probably the murder weapon. A one out of Any sign ten. Of a nope. We have a few the more things to look at. 
Uh, okay, something over there. All the windows were boarded up. The killer must have gone out the back way. What do we know about his android? He had an android? The neighbors confirmed he had one, but it wasn't here when we arrived. Didn't exactly look like he should have an android, given his state of life. I thought they were expensive. Okay, there's some club. That's not really great. Um, is there stuff in here? Well, there's something to look at there. More blood. Yep, from uh, Carlos again. Um, what, what's there to look at here? More blood. Yeah, okay. Lots and lots of blood. We get it. Read. No, I don't want to read that, but I noticed... Um, no, I don't, I don't want to look at any of that. But I did notice that uh, I... The reading gave me something last time. I, 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 part of the thing. Is your android spying on you? No, no, definitely not. Okay, I've I've read it all. That that's fine. I I've done all of the things that I can do. Now looking outside, absolutely nothing outside. Okay, looking there. Well, uh, a knife missing. Now that could actually be useful. Anything else around here? Oh, yeah, looking outside again. Still nothing. Um, looking around. Oh, there's something to examine there. And a baseball bat. Lovely. It's got some fingerprints on it. Um, Carl Autos. Theft and upgraded assault. Yeah. And something up here. Um, violent impact. Traces of Ethereum. Okay. Not sure what that is. Okay, what happened? Okay. Looks like he was going to hit something and then just didn't. Okay, yeah, there was something else. So Deviant took a knife. Okay, it looked like Carl Oss was not being, uh, not playing nice, not playing nice at all. And so to protect himself, the Deviant. Oh, well, now Deviant, the android, just, uh, just killed him, I guess? Was attacked, yes. Um, anything else? Is that everything? He's right, sick to move. Yep, yeah, I think that's everything there. So, protecting himself, once again. Chris, is this written in the victim's blood? Robert oh, there's so. something written in the analysis. victim's blood? That's, that's terrible. Okay, um... Red ice. Maybe. Oh, it was the I am alive thing. Okay. Oh, there's, there's stuff written in there. That's okay. He seemed kind of crazy. That's really weird. Oh, there's something down there. A statue. In the shower. That's weird. Okay. This has suddenly gotten really weird and kind of creepy. Anyway, let's let's get out of here. Um, I just want to see if there's anything else in here before I leave. No, nope, the bathroom is all clear. Consider it done, Lieutenant. Let's go back to where the murder actually took place. Oh yeah, there's one thing I didn't see. Of course, there's always just that one thing. You guys don't need samples. I've already like taken all the samples. It's great. Um, fingerprints, of course. Sign of a struggle. Of course, there was a struggle. Okay, 7 out of 10. I reckon the last three would be, like, near the victim's body. 1, 2, and 3. There we go. Okay, you have step over the evidence. Okay, that is the knife that uh, I already knew was gone. So let's analyze it. No fingerprints, android involvement. Um, yeah, we kind of already guessed that. So, android was involved. Now, excuse me. Let's go have a look at him. Examine it. Oh, wow, there are maggots on him and everything. He did not look like a very nice person. Okay, yeah, let's look at a, a lot of knife wounds. 28 stab wounds. 19 days ago, okay. Let's have a look at him. Um, acetone of uh, red ice, okay. So I guess something... I, I don't know if red ice is a real thing now, but I know ice is. Uh, yeah, he's dead. Carlos Ortiz, 5'6", uh, quite large. Um, there should be one more thing. Iron his hand. Uh, theft and aggravated assault. Yeah, fingerprints, etc. Reconstruct. Uh, let's go there. So he was, he was stabbed a few times there, I think. Oh, he tripped over the bottles. Of course, the drink actually did end up killing you. Okay. 
Let's keep on going. That's where he was last stabbed. So, he gets stabbed once or twice there. And then the Deviant keeps going and stab. And then he keeps going and then he, like, goes over the bottle and then is stabbed and stabbed and stabbed and stabbed and stabbed. Wow. That Deviant really, really hated Carlos. Um, what are we looking at here? The android? They came from the kitchen. Yeah, we also knew that as well. I, I kind of did this backwards. Um, okay, but we can exit that now. Let's stab wounds, yep. Is that everything? He was stabbed oh, you times. think? Okay, 20 yeah. times. Seems like the killer really had it in for. Yeah. Yes, it did. Um, is there anything? Oh, yes, the I am alive. Analyze. Is Carl Ortis's font Cyberlife Sans? Oh wow, it's even the font that Cyberlife uses. That's kind of uh, incriminating. Um, okay, there's a few more things over there. I thought there was only like one more piece of evidence, but there's there's a few more things to look at. Examine whatever this is. Ah, the drugs. That's that's lovely. Red ice, acetone, lithium, etc., etc. Lots of chemicals. Okay, that's all the evidence, but there were two more things to look at. Some all the way over there. I, I can't leave a stone unturned. So let's have a look at this. Oh, back. Outside. I'm not sure I really need to look outside. But I'm going to anyway. Yep, it's, it's just a backyard. Not a very nice backyard. I can't even use my uh, scanning ability. There's a mound of dirt. Oh, oh, there's some. Okay, looking at the footprints. Let me guess, they're gonna be like cyber life footprints. Uh only oh, sixty minutes ago. Inside. Killer must have gone out this way. There are no footprints apart from Officer Collins size ten shoes. Well this happened weeks ago. Tracks could have faded. True. No. This type of soil would retain a trace. Nobody's been out here for a long time. Okay, well that's good to know. You wouldn't have got picked up that, Lieutenant. You need me. You do. Okay. That is everything. So now I go and talk to him, I reckon. That's the last thing to do. Talk. 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 There we go. I think I figured out what happened. Oh, yeah? Shoot. I'm all ears. It all started... Uh, in, in the kitchen. In the kitchen. Yeah, that's what happened. Yeah, there the baseball bat. Signs of a struggle. The question is, what exactly happened here? I can tell you that. The victim attacked the android with the bat. With the bat. Yep. That lines up with the evidence. Go on. See, I'm I'm doing well so far. This is good. I have all the evidence. Let's keep on going. Um, the victim stabbed the android. The android stabbed the victim. The android threw the chair. No, no, no. The android the stabbed, the victim. stabbed the victim. Oh, I couldn't read it all in time. So the android was trying to defend itself, right? Okay, then what happened? The victim fled to... The land room. The living room. That one. The living room. Yeah, okay. We saw that. Through the chair. That didn't do much to the android. He's just stumbling around. Obviously, he's been stabbed a few times at this point. And he tried to get away from the android. Alright, that makes sense. The android murdered the victim. With the knife, obviously. With the knife. Just okay. stab, stab, and stab. Your theory's not totally ridiculous. But it doesn't tell us where the android went. It was damaged by the bat. Yes. And lost some therium. Lost well, some what? Therium. You call it blue blood. It's the fluid that powers androids' bio components. So he's gonna need to get some more blood. It evaporates after a few hours and becomes invisible to the naked eye. Oh. But I bet you can still see it, can't you? Yes, I can. Yeah. So now we need to look for that therium. Okay, he went that way. Um, 
problem, but he didn't go out the back door. Which is kind of weird. So where, where is he gone? He's gone that way. Come on, get out of the way, officer. I'm doing some good work here. He's gone that way. Oh, wow, Ethereum everywhere. Okay, let's keep on going. Oh, there's more stuff around here. Okay, let's examine. Do you, like, stumble here? Oh, there's something there. A ladder or something? A ladder! Yes, okay. Wow, that's interesting. Oh, he fled through the... the manhole. Huh. I wasn't expecting that one. Open up here. And there's the android. Nope, it's a mop and a broom and all that. That actually scared Connor as well. That's kind of funny. Is that everything? Uh, no, we... Yeah, I think that is. Find something to climb. Okay. What could we possibly climb here? Given that he doesn't have the ladder anymore. Let's just have a look in here because it looked like... Uh, he did seem to come in here. Maybe the android set that up. Because there is, there is a bit of Ethereum around there. Anyway, we need to find something to climb. Maybe there's something in the kitchen? A chair. Can I take a chair? Or that? What, 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 what's that? Well, that's that's the that's the magazine. Okay, yeah, let's take the chair. Take. Awesome. Hey, 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 what are you doing with that chair? I'm going to check something. Come on, just leave me alone. If he's still in there... Check something. That's... That would be crazy. This could suddenly get very intense. Okay, open it up. There's holes in the roof, so he could have easily gotten out. He's still there. The android is actually still there. It's because that shadow. You can see him as well. Oh my goodness. At least androids don't have fear, right? So, you, Connie, you can just get straight in there. Oh, that's, it's not, it's not, it's a mannequin. Okay. I just saw it through the curtains. Bet you the Deviant's still gonna be here. It's just gonna pop out of nowhere. Look for Deviant. Yep, he kept going. Okay, they really tried to scare us once. I won't let it happen again. The camera angle is... There he is in there! And he's alive! Even after losing Ethereum, he's still alive. Why would he stay here, though? I mean, maybe he didn't think a android would be smart enough to actually find him. Can I see him? Where is he? Oh, there's something red in the background. Come on, keep going. I can't use my scan anymore. Yep, there he is. Sup, Deviant. You don't look too good. Why did you stay here then? I'm gonna have to choose between the deviant it's here, and the cop. Oh shit! Chris, Ben, get your asses in here now. Or at least I didn't have to make that choice. Come on! He's gonna attack me? No. At least he feels sorry for what he's done. There we go. Wow, I did a fair bit. A a lot. Wow, how, how much percentage did I get there? I did 75%. Okay. Uh, there's, there's a few things that I didn't do, apparently. But not too much. And then I ended up finding the Deviant. But there was one more thing I could have done or something there. Anyway, that was intense. So the first half of this video, we uh, played as Marcus. And then we uh, helped out Carl and all that. That was pretty fun. I really like Carl. I, I hope he uh, keeps uh, being in the story. Then we go back to Connor. We find um, this uh, guy in the bar, the lieutenant. And then we come back to the crime scene. And we found the Deviant. After a lot of detective work, we ended up finding him. And now, what are we going to do with this Deviant? Who knows? Anyway, 
I hope you enjoyed that video. Please remember to like and subscribe for more. And comment down below if you want me to keep on doing Detroit Become Human. So far, it's a pretty good game, so I think I will. So thank you for watching, and cheers, everyone.